Welcome back to Silent Hill. In the last episode, we went to the roof and we got a key to drain out of somewhere where it was stuck. Don't know what the key is for. Don't know where it drained to. But it's somewhere in the building. So let's explore the second floor, which I haven't really touched at all, except for the two bathrooms in the very bottom left. Ooh, this one's locked, so it can be opened. So that's a candidate for what the key might be for. Although the key, once I find the key, it'll probably tell me what it's for. I hope. That one's also just locked, not jammed. Oh, there's three of them? Actually, I have the ammo to take care of them. But is it worth it? Is there anything I need in here? I'm gonna run past them and just see if there's anything I need to even worry about in here. No, 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 come on, come on, come on, grab it, quick! Yeah, there's nothing I need in here. Because it'll save me a lot of ammo not to have to take out three of them. God, the piano. Shotgun shells. Didn't want to waste ammo on it, but it's fine. It's fine. I'm orange, that's not fine. Okay. Yeah, no way to open that. So this is the hallway where the music and the locker room are. Um, yeah, I guess I might as well go here. I've already explored the two classrooms in the hallway that I'm just coming from, so pretty much done there. Yeah. All right. Okay. I hate these damn bugs. Red. Okay. Medkit time. Still got a lot of rounds, actually. 15 plus 45, which if I've done the math right, equals 60. Someone just hanging out there. Literally hanging, not like hanging out. I mean, hanging. No. Not again. Remember before it was the cat? What is it this time? Oh, 
Okay. Great. Oh, fuck. Library reserve key. Thanks. Body is slumped over. Check out the music room. Okay, library reserve. Yeah, so I can just get there by going back out to the hallway behind me, and we should be able to get there no problem. Okay, I just took a bunch of damage. Gonna take a health drink. Um, because I had to run back through the two classrooms that have three of those enemies each in them to get back here. I might, if I have to go back through those classrooms, I think I'm gonna have to kill them. I can't just keep taking damage every time I have to go back and forth through there. But hopefully I won't. I think it's this one. Medkit thing. What's that? Sounds like someone knocking. Hearing this, the hunter, armed with bow and arrow, said, I will kill the lizard. But upon meeting his opponent, he held back, taunting, Who's afraid of a reptile? At this, the furious lizard hissed, I'll swallow you up in a single bite. Then the huge creature attacked, jaws opened wide. This was what the man wanted. Calmly drawing his bow, he shot into the lizard's gaping mouth. Effortlessly, the arrow flew, piercing the defenseless maw, and the lizard fell down dead. This is from an old fairy tale. I remember reading it as a kid. I intensely don't like that, because I think what it's saying to me is that I'm going to have to fight something, maybe a boss, and I'm going to have to get it to open its mouth to reveal its weak point and shoot it. Yeah. Where does this door go? Oh, this hallway. A couple of classrooms and I can also go down to the boiler from here. Hmm, sure would like a save point. At least that's unlocked. Wait, if that's locked, then... Where the hell do I go? Huh. I'm confused. So, I found a key, right? I went to the... Was it the lab equipment room? Um, no, the locker room. 
So going to the locker room and that body fell out, that gave me the key to the library reserve. Which suggests to me, if there's a key for the library reserve, that's probably not an extra area I just went to, right? It's probably the case that there's something in there I need to progress. But what did I actually get from there? I got some nice supplies. I got some ammo and a health kit. And I read that thing about the, the gaping mob, but... I, I don't have any new, like, information or tools that I can use to figure out how to progress. Unless just by reading that book that triggered something? Maybe it is just kind of an extra thing, I don't know. And this says it's locked, so again, it can be unlocked. Well. So... Fully explore the first floor. Yeah. Fully explored this floor. Yeah. And that's just the roof, of course. Yeah, I don't see any way to get to the boiler room. Because all my ways seem to be blocked. So, I think what I need to do at this point is find out where that key that I flushed down the drain ended up. I've already looked around the second floor, pretty much everywhere. Except I haven't checked the bathrooms on the very bottom left and the only way to get to the bathrooms is from that weird door thing you see down there near the bathrooms on the first floor if you remember if I go into one of the bathrooms from the first floor over there it'll uh, when I come out of it it'll then be on the second floor that's how I get there I'm guessing the keys probably there okay when I come out of here I should be on the second floor at the bathrooms and I am Okay, could be in the other bathroom. Hmm. Alright, so the key's not here. Um, I have another idea then. My idea is to explore reception. Because there's enemies in this hallway, so I wasn't able to explore reception. I was only able to go behind reception. And I also haven't had a chance to go into the lobby. Sweet, blissful silence. Oh. There is no reception anymore, is there? A wheelchair at an elementary school. I... I you... Harry, you do you know that children use wheelchairs too, right? I mean, granted, this one's way, way, way too big to be for a child, but... Yeah. Okay. Well, in that case, I'm a bit lost. I don't know where that key would be. Oh, hey! Here's the key. I wasn't even looking for it in the courtyard. But, yeah, it's in the courtyard. I never found this before, so I never even thought to look here. Classroom key. Which classroom would that be for? That's gotta be for the second floor classroom, right? Yeah. It's gotta be that classroom on the top right of the map. Because if I can get into there, I can probably get into the lower classroom. Which will then take me into that hallway. 
spot that I have not ever been to. Here we go, into the locked classroom. Hmm. Well, let me try the other door. Okay. Still pretty green, slightly orange. Might as well unlock this. Not that it matters. ammo and I'm worried about health enough that I'm just going to shoot those. Here's the entrance to the boiler room. Ah, <sighs> unlocked. Feeling the boiler room is going to be a bit bigger than it was before. You know? This handle feels vaguely familiar. Oh, I've seen this handle from the other side. Right, I'm not actually into the boiler room yet, I'm just on the first floor. Ah, that unlocks, cool. This is the lowest floor. Check storage first. Are those all shotgun shells? I'm so scared. Why are they giving me so many shotgun shells? Ampule. I thought there was a thing there. What is that? Is that a healing item? Relieves pain to recover stamina too high. Effect lasts for a while. I'm pretty sure when they say stamina, they mean health, basically. Because that's what the medkit says as well. So yeah, I guess it's just a really strong medicine. It says effect lasts for a while, though. I don't know what that means. Does that mean, like, you're stronger than normal? Like, you can take more hits for a while or something? Between that and the shotgun shells, we are definitely coming up on a boss fight. this camera angle. Hmm. Turn the valve left, turn the valve right, stop turning the valve. So what am I trying to do? Is this like a spinny thing? Probably need all the teeth to move out of the way. Oh. 
Yep. Do I just need to figure this out as I go, or was there a hint somewhere? I mean, the thing about the lizard certainly wasn't related to this, right? Okay, so this one's out of the way. But, I mean, it turns both, right? So... Oh. There we go. I got it. Yeah, just messed around with them for a bit. Once again, another case where progress feels horrible. Yay, I solved the puzzle. Also, what the hell is in here? Something bad. Deeper. Of course we're going deeper. Oh god. Hmm. Okay. Um, hold on. Jesus Christ, where the fuck am I? There's a burning fire thing in the center. Looks like there's a sort of humanoid figure in the fire, kind of. And also there's a huge monster. This is going to be a shotgun. Time. I have many shots for it. 30, to be exact. Remember what I heard about the lizard, the fairy tale? Wait for it to open its mouth so that I can shoot it in the maw? Alright. Haven't saved in a while and I don't have many healing items. It's... Jesus, what is that? It's not particularly fast though. Just checking the environment. Is there anything else here? No. Yeah. Okay, I think I just gotta wait for it to come to me. That didn't open its mouth. It's not opening its mouth! How hurt am I? Not really at all. Okay. Yeah, ampule and medkit, that's it. Is that thing in the center? Ooh. No. Ah! <laughs> Teaching me how to use melee weapons. Yeah, not really an appropriate tip here. See, a newer game would make a quick save. It would make an auto save at the beginning of that boss fight. But this isn't a newer game, so I'll see you in a while. Oh, wait a minute. It did make an auto save, just without telling me. Thank God. That's generous. Right, I don't know exactly what triggered it to open its mouth. Was it just shooting it until it, like, leaked goo? Okay, hold on, hold on. It seems to be, like, splitting apart. Now is probably a pretty good time. Let's reload this. I'm going to take my ampule. Did something happening? Whoa, what the hell? Uh, I think my emulation broke. 
I'm just gonna wait a second. Sounds like something's ending. Okay, it seems like the emulation broke there for a minute. I don't know what happened. But I guess I just needed to hit it once with its mouth open and ends the fight. Huh? What was that? Who in the hell was that? Man, that wasn't Cheryl. Where am I? This is a boiler room. Yeah, this is the normal boiler room. What's going on here? Bell's ringing. It's time for something. K. Gordon Key. K. Gordon? I think that's the name of one of the teachers, right? Huh. Okay, well, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, we're going to go figure out what that ring is about and figure out what this K. Gordon Key is for.